Orion on the uh, stage. Let's get it going, man. Luigi and Wolf. Got French versus UK set. Love that at UFA. You see the respect that Orion has not looking to scrap. Play that mid-range. Shoot the gun or the platforms if necessary. But take those hits and really push them to the fullest. It's a character like Luigi who isn't the strongest but has some deadly reversals. Oh my god, the Zare conversion. Looking for the wave dash to the right side up B, but never mind. And again, you can't really challenge Luigi. If your combos aren't airtight, there's no point trying to extend. Of course, Luigi has that frame one reversal with down B with invincibility and of course the frame three there. He can, you know, you can't really touch him if the combos aren't uh, true for sure. So you do have to watch out, you know, uh, no strings attached, so to speak. Absolutely. Warren playing very evasive, but playing that game very well, avoiding the moves like up smash, um, avoiding grabs, and trying to come in at these awkward angles to set up the, these advantageous ledge situations and find that backhead to take first stock. Not able to get that true follow up, but still stays safe, kind of flanking with that hitbox, and you'll take that if you're Orion. Okay, Zare, love that, you know, wait, of course, you know, gets the Tomahawk. Uh, nothing from it, though. Moving from Lugi, lovely, lovely parry turn around grab. And we won't do it, but it's approaching kill percent for a lot of stray Luigi moves. Ooh, just because of that down smash, uh, Orion gonna have that ability just to burst through it, of course, and then you get the ledge trap, of course, and the back air sneaking in, and great first game for Orion. He's looking confident here. Even on a stage where you, you kind of have to scrap, you have to engage with Luigi, Orion just coming out on top consistently. But it doesn't really matter too much because all he needs is one grab. But the smash fill height helps him a little, I guess, surviving just about despite that extended combo from the grab. 91% is still a lot, but you'll take that over dying. Yeah, and trading with the down air, of course, Luigi has those annoying moves he can always trade with. And the case gets us there, gets the tech chase, doesn't get that hit though. Uh, tries to the down smash, letting that head swing too. No kill right there until the back air. Still, Orion is going to be living, gets the side B, the sweet spot as well. But Lugi still staying alive. Yes, the up smash brings us back to an even stock position. And being real, this is still even. It's yep. like one grab away. I, I hate same, to play the trope, but. He literally just needs one grab. And now you see Orion. Maybe he should take like maybe a fireball to the face and then run away just for that damage and those zeros are gonna occur. But of course, uh, he might know better than me. Firing out the lasers, treating that uh, that platform like your best friend. I told you, you have to romanticize it. Take it out the dinner if you have to. Something. And now this chip damage has been applied. It's a little scarier to actually board the platforms because I've seen Lugi convert from from a straight forward out on, uh, onto the platform yeah. into into death. Now everything becomes scary for Orion. This is where that pressure comes in, that mental stack, the fear of losing at any given percent. You need to keep this strong position and really rely on it. Finds that after smash, takes game one, not allowing any silly business here as Orion takes game one. You're good, but I am better. Yeah, Orion with a, uh, started really strong, right? And then obviously I think Lugi kind of, not to say exactly woke up, but kind of like, you know, kind of uh, sat forward in the chair, you know what I mean? One of those type of memes. And I was really kind of like, you know, taking a stride in. Of course, towards the end, Orion was able to kind of like, you know, battle the storm, uh, weather it, of course, and take that that final stop. But definitely was kind of creeping in. Lugi was, you know, trying to understand what Orion was kind of putting out, spacing a lot of his aerials on Orion's side, but Lugi was doing a really good job weaving in and out, getting those Zed conversions especially. Just has to convert them into kills this time uh, instead of just straight hits. Mm. Yeah, it, it's... It's interesting. It's it's funny to say that like only only getting like zero to ninety is like not enough for Luigi. Like, he, like he, he wants that he wants that grab, um, and he has to find a way to deal with. It's almost air camping. How how Orion is abusing his the wolf drift to stay out of the threat zone or only come in when it's really his turn. He has to find the ways of dealing with it, and I feel like that that comes down to just like calling out the timing of the jumps and throwing out something preemptive with like a, like a Luigi uh, back air. Mm -hmm. You made a really good point about the mental stack of when it's last stock, and you can get one grab, you might die, so I feel like that might play a part again in the second game uh, too, but okay, can't attack Luigi's shield for free. You're gonna have to play a certain type of attacks, but okay, Orion making Luigi pay right now until there's reversals. You, again, you can't challenge Luigi too freely. Especially when he was below the smash platform, you, you often you just wait under there. Because yep. if he down Bs, you just up, wait for it and up air after. But he, he's going to keep trying to press that advantage, just trying to hit hit things which aren't guaranteed. And it's the third time in a row. You have to be on, asking questions if you're Orion, because you're getting grabbed. You're not going to find a follow-up because you're on the edge of that platform. can't uh, input a dash into reverse back air. Keeping Orion alive now. But that's another down B, but he keeps alive just about. Yeah, really strong shot from Luigi. Uh, from Lugi especially, gets the back throw, and again, this is where now, now you have to approach Luigi 
on 0%. One of the worst things you can ever do in this game, for sure. Uh, and I can name a few of them, uh, especially. But of course, Orion again, just trying to find his time, trying to find the opening. Uh, but okay, gets the Nair to back L forward, should I say. Good deep, but still able to get back in time to set up a ledge trap. But this is getting to a lot more scary. When you're down a stock, you have, the pressure is on you to try and... Yeah to try and get that hit, try and get that stock, and that means you're more at risk of committing on bad terms and getting grabbed, getting getting hit for your troubles. And Lugi plays these these situations so, so well typically. Okay, where do we go now? You see Orion just taking his time to go back to center stage, doesn't even want to deal with any reversal that Lugi can put out, and finds the back air, just not the sweet spot, uh, spot of that back air part, uh, and getting back to stage apart from a scrappy option at the moment. Orion just wants one kill, but can Lugi find his one first? Gets a down B. Really good DI to survive, but again, how do you land now? So hard. If you can't afford to land anywhere near on top of Luigi, but it means the small the small nature of Smash means there's not really much space for Luigi to land on you. So you get a hit, you get a conversion. Crazy for Luigi to smash grab in that situation. He's pressing a lot of buffer buttons out of this advantage, but it, it works. That's the Luigi way. You have to play around that if, if you're Orion. Again, it's one of those characters where you just need patience, you know what I mean? You know Luigi's going to be throwing out these options. It's on you to kind of like, you know, wait for them, punish them accordingly. You can't punish the start. It's more about punishing the end lag. And of course, uh, Luigi, not really a favorable fan of that. So many times where Orion is trying to go for a conversion off a landing fair, there's just been combo broken by that frame one invincible cyclone. Gets a grab, gets nothing, but still picks it up and sort of drops it, picks oh it back up again. The reset? He'll take that. Only 52. I think Orion will take that over dying. Yeah. But given that he's a stock down, you won't really be able to afford to take getting hit anymore. I love these fireballs kind of anti air keep you in that zone on the ground. That's where Luigi wants you, so he can plunge you to death. Gets the reflector out finally. Big dash attack at a trade, but still in the favorable position for Orion. Ledge trap situation. So he's been favoring. Goes for the down smash. Luigi still gets away from it. And again, they're just scrapping to get center stage. Like Luigi's typically not great off ledge. Is that going to be it? Credits Orion, he's been getting this DI consistently. He's not died off the top to it just yet. But you're running out of opportunities. Straight up smash does it, straight back air. And of course the grab will lead to your demise. Not rolling in, expect, not expecting the missed tech as well. Gives Orion one final chance to mount a huge comeback. He's not been scouting these rolls that second time in a row that Luigi, Luigi has rolled from ledge. Orion's not been able to cover it and, um, and he's been hit for the troubles. You have to, you have to be playing around that. The, the highest reward reversal that you can, you can that Luigi can do. You have to play around that. You need to right. deter that at all costs. Yeah, I'd be taking a big swig of my water like that if I had to deal with Luigi as well, man. I feel you, Orion. I feel you. It can be hard. But of course, you know, doing a good job of kind of uh, the first game and, and towards the first half of that second game as well, it's just about digging deep. You know what I mean? Again, it's always about punishing the end lag of Luigi. Start up, there's no point. You know, frame one reversal, frame three reversals, and even other moves as well that you just don't want to be trading. Of course, uh, you know, Orion can do it, but a third game now in Smashville, this seems to be where we're going to be staying for this whole set. Yeah, Orion content with playing the, the sort of close mid-range game, not trying to camp away. It's easier to get Luigi off stage, but you have less room to run away. Drops the combo, but still keeps this pressure up where Luigi excels so much. Looking for a conversion, not going to find an up B, going for an up air instead. But that's a grab, that's a back air, and an advantageous position for Lugi. I feel like Orion's issue in this third game is trying to scrap too heavy with Luigi, and you can't fight the boy. You know what I mean? That little scaredy cat can box. Exactly. Every time you engage, it gives Lugi an op a, a window to yep. hit. Get a hit in, get a stock. You need to make the most of this. This situation it feels like you can't really pressure Luigi meaningfully off stage here and if you don't get the kills at ledge either it means Luigi has a lot of opportunities to stay alive opportunities to get one grab can we finally get the, the zero to death off a grab not gonna find it but a lot of damage either it's your Orion like, getting frustrated. It just feels like Orion's pressing down just a bit too much. Gets the misfire, gonna get back to stage for free. No F tilt ledge trapping so far. Can't find the mark. Can't show the claws either. Okay, gonna roll out. Of course, good option from Luigi. Can't really chase it too well. And L Lugi still looking strong, forcing Orion on this mono platform to make sure he can't feel comfortable. So he's able to push this advantage further. You need to get this stock off ASAP if you're Orion. You take a lot of damage and you are dying. Not able to get that Mario game party. DI, not going to find that mini game DI, not going to find um, a way to survive on that second stock. You are going to get the upset eventually, but this is a huge, huge amount of time if you're Orion playing around. The first 
the first 50-50, uh, punishing the air dodge, but not able to uh, punish the Cyclones to getting hit for his troubles. Okay, gets the Zera out, gonna avoid the fireball as well, but again, I feel like Orion's are scrapping too heavy. Of course, you do have to fight Luigi now that you're in a deficit, which is one of the worst uh, things you could possibly do against him, but, you know, maybe you have to buy just a little bit more. Going to the F-Smash, maybe a bit too overzealous with it, and now you're dealing with these pivot grabs. Luigi been finding a lot of, uh, you know, reward off these pivot grabs. Can't find it right there. Orion bringing it to one stock apiece. We're not down and out yet, Focus. We're still going. Needed to hit that back air. Needs to mount a comeback. One final game left. Wait, hang on. I, I can't lie, I thought it was to a down. My fault. Yeah, but that's a down B, even after getting hit, having to land now. And again, can't land against him for free. Yeah, you're running out of opportunities. You're very frail at the moment. Woo, the up tilt. Lugi looking for Bludge. Lavaquez. Looking for up smashes, finds it. Hits almost on top of the platform. Yep. And gets that stop. Takes another game. I don't know if he was reading or reacting either way, but Orion was looking for a lot of the time uh, throughout the set, has been looking for a lot of plat uh, drop aerials, right? And of course, you know, so such a strong option from uh, from Wolf, but of course going up against Luigi with that type of up smash, you know the Mario characters all have invincible up smashes, I swear, so you don't want to be challenging that head-swinging idiot uh, when he's going to, you know, let it rip from anywhere, high percent especially. Orion doing a really good job. Again, it's always in the late half of these games where it's exactly, not exactly waking up, but kind of like, you know, like I said before, sitting forward, understanding, hey man, I need to really lock in and do something, but unfortunately, uh, it just seemed to be just that little, uh, too little, too late. So it's For real, it, it's so hard to play under that pressure. It is that mental stack. There's so many options that you need to be wary of because they can lead to, um, to you losing. If you can control that, you control your fear. Just understand what what uh, Lugi is looking for. You get to play the game. You get to have your turn. It's not the, it's not the strongest character, but when when you're in your own head, it can be so hard to play around. Good start from Orion, really safe damage. Not going to, uh, you know, to overextend these combos. Just getting, like I said before, the, those strings attached type of combos, you know what I mean? Get the combos, not the strings. But okay, Lugi looking for a combo of his own. Nothing from it though, but still decent damage, okay? Dash attack off the stage and Wolf in an unfavorable position. Oh man. Able to get back on with that roll, but sent right back. Oh, that's a very unexpected Wolf Flash. Caught Lugi off guard, not able to tech it. He's a stop down, but not for very long. <laughs> He's so consistent with combos like that. Zen to up tilt and Darby, you'll love that. And that down B cycling scoops from below the platform. That is a crazy, crazy move. What can you get from this? Just keeping big damage, but keeping a good position. I, was gonna, I thought he was going to go for the grab. He gets the up tilt. No up tilt. Up B right there. And okay, another up tilt. He's looking for the up B confirm for sure. Uh, on a, a fast follow like Wolf. Keeping on the ledge right now. Gets the pivot grab. Kept Orion locked in shield. Goes for the down B. Maybe a bit of missed timing on that. And okay, no punish right now. And Orion, both of them are kind of just throwing out buttons. Maybe in a bit of a, a scared situation. Very messy stuff. But Orion gets this decisive hit. Not going to find enough head to kill. But keeps this juggle situation going. Lugi Matt pressing a lot of buttons at a hit stun. And Orion seems to be in the right position at any time. But miss messes up once. All Lugi needs is one down B at the right time to take that stock. This is scary stuff. Yeah, he's on his winner stock, uh, winner's side stock, should I say. It's, guys, it's not 1-1. One, one, it is still 2-1 to Lugi. His score has not been updated, but still fighting for his life right now. Last stock. Very even for sense. Lugi looking for an opening. Can he find his way in? Mixing up the timing of when he tries to get a hit. Backing off, staying under the center platform himself. Set, happy to sit under, throw a fireball out, throw, throw a plunger. Come in when he needs to. Oh. That down B is causing so many problems for Orion. It's insane. It's the reversals, man. You can't challenge Luigi all the time. Goes for the S smash again. A little bit, just that little bit overzealous. You don't want to be dealing with it. Now the up air into the air, reverse up air, back air as well. So many conversions. Just the recovery. Just being able to get it by the skin of his teeth. Oof. Uh, Orion in a little bit of trouble right now. Has to find something to kind of get back uh, and steer it into his favor. They're running out of time. Down. Bro, it's a misfire. No. You didn't want to go there. Do you have a jump? Bro, did he know he was going to get misfire? How did he? Like, who goes for that? Bonkers, bonkers option. Doesn't matter. He gets that that W. Moves on. I don't think he meant to do that. I think he just wanted full drift down B. 
But you'll take that. You didn't Bro, die for it. Didn't <laughs> lose the aim. You, you'll love that. That looked planned. That looked like he wanted <laughs> down throw or whatever throw he got and into a misfire. But either way, uh, Lugi just getting that uh, out of nowhere, man. That seems to be the kind of story for him. It's always out of nowhere, you know what I mean? And being able to, you know, scrap heavy for a long time and get these kills, uh, you know, out of thin air can be so costly. It's so detrimental to your opponent because, like, you know what I mean? How do I fight you if you can just get kills, uh, you know, whenever you feel like it? And Luigi is that type of character. Mm. Such a strong, uh, you know, situation you have to deal with and it can be very, very daunting. Absolutely. I wouldn't be surprised if Rory makes a run, but I'm, I'm looking, Lugi is looking promising in winners. I think if he's got the right, if he's got the right mindset, he, he's feeling himself, he is so, so hard to stop. Of course, Stephens guys, now. hope you guys are enjoying the stream so far. It's been a blast at the moment. We're going to get Leon onto the stage, I believe, uh, for this next set. Uh, but before we do that, I just want to give a big shout out to Display, of course, uh, you know, providing a lot of posters out. Oh, and you can get your own one as well. You can't um, have like a pin on them, but what you can do is because they have magnets, you're going to stick them onto the wall. So they're very accessible, and I believe. Um, 